Welcome back to another video. This is my 19th this league and I've been absolutely loving every single second of it. Just pretend the last week didn't exist. I have the shadow now. I'm back to sleeping four hours a night. Not because I need to or want to. That's just what my body is doing. The grind is back on. I'm rank 11 with 67,000 points. But with the shadow, I'm going to climb and climb. And the goal today is to go all the way to 70,000 points. Let's get started. First up is the Leviathan. Realistically, I should be doing Duke first for the ring but I just got the shadow. I want to shoot things fast and kill them fast, and that's what the Leviathan is all about. This KC task all the way up to 300, as well as 200 points for Avertis piece, 200 points for the Venator ring, 200 points for Fletch and 100 Dragon Javelins, and 600 points for full Virtus if I can spoon it just like Joel Emission. So let's hit this combo breaker. Oh shit, it already started? Oh, with a scepter. I see. Oh shit. Is that the boss? No way, what the hell? 0.43. Dude, I'm a beast. 5kc Awakener's Orb, I'll probably get a lot of those. I'm not going to do the Awakened version just yet. I'm obviously learning all this content on the fly, but I hope I'll be able to do it by the end of the league. What's that? Oh. Wait. Without doing Monkey Madness 2, the only place you can get Dragon Javelin Heads as a drop is literally the DT2 bosses. Got 81 here. I need 20 more for 200 points. I just got a Awakener's Orb on my 50th KC, dude. What the? What am I on? 67,160. The collection log. Chromian Imgot. That's what I need for the ring, right? You need three of them. I have, I have one. Them, you'll definitely get them. You'll I have one already from my one KC Duke. You ever seen the clip of Alfie getting one of those? No, did he freak out? Oh! Chromium ingots! Oh, I just got back to back chromium ingots, dude! What the fuck? Got the dragon javelin heads that we needed. Points on points on points! I gotta get out of here, dude. Bro, do you have to use normal logs to make fucking javelin heads? I can't use maple logs. And that is Fletch 100 dragon javelins. 200 points, 67,360. Now let's hit the refresh, and we've taken rank 10 back, and we're actually, if we get the Virtus piece, we can take rank 9. I have not seen progress like this in years. Let's go. Virtus row bottom, let's go, dude. 84kc, 200 points, 67,560. Do I get a rank, though? Do I get a rank? That's the question. All right, let's hit the refresh. Rank 9, we're back to single digits. We haven't seen that in days, dude. Shout out the Shadow. It's opened up so much possibilities for us. That Virtus piece is obviously huge for us as well, as with the Shadow, it multiplies all your Mage bonus by 3, or your Mage damage by 3. And right now, I only have the Imbued Mage Cape, but now I have a Virtus piece too. If I can get those extra two pieces, I'm laughing straight to the bank. 200 points, we get to 67,760 points for 35 mil agility. I totally just didn't die at Leviathan while ordering my KFC. 799 tasks too as well, so one more task, I'm at 800. Ooh! Venator v Vistage. Vestige, dude. Oh, shit. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Okay. Oh, You've already got the Schwarmium Ingots Yeah, I've got, well. I've got all the Schwarmium Ingots. I'm going to stay to 150 KC before I make it. And that is 150 KC at the Leviathan. I might honestly just NS 300 KC because that's 200 points. 67,840 points. Let's go make this vendor ring and get over 60, 68,000. I was doing my math wrong. All right, and let's make this vendor ring. We got three Schwarmium ingots here. Craft the vendor ring. This process cannot be reversed. Absolutely. Wear a vendor ring, 200 points, 68,040 points. Very, very nice. She was like, she was kind of like flirting with me a little bit. Oh, I got another Venator Vistage. That doesn't do anything though. GG. She's kind of flirting uh, me a bit. Actually, that is crazy. When did you get the other one? 144. 144, yeah. Holy fuck. What are the odds of that? Very unlikely. Damn, dude. I'm feeling full Virtus in the next 22 kills. All right. 
But yeah, this girl was like, she was talking to us a lot while I had a lot of chips. And then as I started losing the chips, bro, she started talking to me less. Like, what's going uh, yeah, on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on, G? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you not interested anymore? Come on, fam. There's more where that came We were playing with like $1 chips, bro. Like, there's more where that came from. No way, dude. Schwarmium ingot. Schwarmium ingot? I just hit 200 KC, so 98 more kills and we'll get the 200 points. I'm pretty much just doing this all in one sitting, because why not? We'll get us to 68,240 points. No other vert is PC yet. You know, we don't got that Jolo mission RNG, but we're going to spoon the set before 300 KC. I know it. I feel it. Dude, I got a smoke quartz. What the hell is that? Great question, dude. You have no idea. Oh, it's for your um, ancient set, though. Oh, oh, right. I see. 50 more to go. I have 15 kills to spoon the Virtus top and mass, dude. I've, I've, if anyone can do it, it's you. I have bro. a dream, dude. Like that one guy said. Yeah, who was that one guy? Uh, LeBron James. LeBron gang. Sorry. <laughs> and boom, that is 300 KC. Unfortunately, only the Virtus bottom. Nothing else. Defeat the Leviathan 300 times. 200 points get me to 68,240. I'm I honestly, you know, I deserve to spoon the full Virtus set in that 300 KC. Joel Mission did it in 200. I don't know how long it took Maz, but he got it pretty nicely too. But yeah, uh, still need to do the Duke Succulus or whatever. Obviously, I need to get the Magus Ring, and they can also drop me some Virtus pieces. There's a 300 KC task there. Would have preferred to get full Virtus, but I'll just take the bottom. 68,240 points. Let's go do some Pyramid Plunder. 25 Pyramid Plunder is 80 points. I probably already looted it three or four times, so let's go to 25. Alrighty, and that is room 8 of Pyramid Plunder 25 times, getting me 80 points, getting me to 68,320. Hit the relog, and we are rank 9 over Jolo Mission. Yo, if you want to support me further and keep yourself clothed or you drink coffee, go to didabitter.com and buy my merch. Over 50 of you guys have already bought something. There's coffee mugs for coffee drinkers, and every piece of clothing from gym shorts to sweatpants to crewnecks, hoodies, beanies, and hats. Didabitter.com. Every purchase directly supports me. There's 200 point toss for doing it 75 times and 150 times. Probably do that tomorrow or day after. I'm going to sleep. All right, I'm going to get enough supplies for 35 mil crafting. I'm at 25.7 mil. I need like 120k or XP on 07. So I'm just going to buy some chaos rings and stuff. I won't need too much, but yeah. All right, I got 1.4 mil toggle. This will definitely be more than enough to get 35 mil crafting. I don't know if I'll buy a bunch. Like, I don't need to buy stuff for 50 mil crafting yet, but it is nice to have the toggle. All right, 1K diamonds with everything else I have should be enough to get to 25 mil crafting while I edit this video. Alrighty, alrighty. This should be 35 mil crafting in a second, which is going to get me to 68,520 points. The video is rendering, so I can't really do Duke yet or anything crazy like Vorkath. I can probably get started on the fight caves. I did 11 yesterday. I need to get to 15, and I'm very interested to see what this shadow can do. Obviously, I'd like some more mage bonus before then, but it is what it is. 35 mil crafting, 68.5k points. Let's go do some jads, and then once my video is done rendering, or once we're done with 15 jads, we'll figure out what we're doing next. Interested to see what kind of stuff I can hit. Okay, what can I hit on the melee or at 1 HP? Oh my days, a 68. That's mad. Once I have more Virtus pieces, that'll be even higher. Okay, I'm 1 HP again, and this has been a little bit slow because I've also been uploading my YouTube video at the same time. Hopefully the healers don't kill me, because I just want to see if I can rinse Jad real quick. Please don't kill me, healers. It won't even get to them. I'm sure of it. 68s. Dude, I just hit triple 68s. You're dead. You're dead. Healers can't do anything. New PB, even though I was AFK. 18 die. That's so nice. Okay, I'm going to be a bit AFK in the next one, too, because I have to put the thumbnail up and everything. But uh, we should be fine. We should be fine. We need three more KC for 200 points. All right, it's another Jad time. Obviously, this is going to be a bit slower because I was AFK as hell doing my video. Maybe I will eat up when the healers come, but who knows? I feel like I'm gonna kill it too quickly, dude. Yup. <laughs> oh my God, okay, we need to do two more and then we're done with Jads for 200 more points. Okay, can we get a new PB? That's the question. I think we can. Come on, smoke it. Smoke it. Put it in my pipe and smoke it. Boom. 1750, new PB, one more for 200 points. I was a little bit AFK on that. I know I can go quicker, but it doesn't really matter. All right, another Jad. Come on, mate. I almost missed a prayer there. That could have been bad odds. All oh, the healers are right next to him, but I'm still just going to out DPS them. Yep, complete the fight case 15 times. Healer just came into me, but we're chilling. 68,720 points. Obviously, we've already got the pets. I don't need to gamble. Very, very nice. 
I think it might be time to go do Vorkath and do some combat achievements and also get a drop for some points. All right, let's go see how Vorkath is now. Okay, that'll be one of the speed runs. It won't be the other one, I don't think. In under 54 seconds. Yeah, Vorkath Speed Chaser, 111. I need to do better on the acid phase if I want to get the other one. I think it's 54 seconds. I need to go get something that can cure my venom too. Don't know how I didn't do that. Astro. Big hits, I can get it right now. Big hits, big hits. Come on, dead. Surely that's it. That's surely under 54 seconds. Boom, yep. 47 seconds, Vorkast speedrunner, nice. Very, very easy. Boom. And I didn't even need to hit it during the Wooks walk phase, which I don't really know how to do with Mage, to be honest. Potential combo breaker coming up. I need to do three more combat achievements, which are killing it 100 times killing it with my fists, and hitting it 12 times during its acid phase without taking any special damage. Now I remember killing it with my fists last league and that was pretty easy, so I'm going to try and hit it 12 times first, I'm going to be using darts. And when I have to go to 100 KC, there's a chance I get the 1 in 200 Dragon Bone Necklace, which is 200 points, or the 1 in 1k Skeletal Visage for 200 points. Bruh. You guys like that? I threw in the Inferno music for the walk. But yeah, we got it done. Now I just need to kill it with my fists and then kill it a hundred times. So it turns out this task was so easy for me last league because I had the melee relic, which made me attack two times faster, as well as give me insane damage and attack bonuses. This time around, not so much. I literally had to leave my first attempt like nine minutes into the kill because I saw how bad I was doing and my supplies and combat potions just weren't gonna cut it. All right, I was literally been there for 20 minutes. I made no progress. So we're gonna go with the new inventory. Yeah, this is gonna be four super combats to get the kill with. This task is actually terrible. I've been here for 30 to 40 minutes at this point and it's just at about 25% health. I'm so inaccurate and do such little DPS that it naturally regens HP more than I'm hitting it sometimes. And every six attacks, it does a special attack. And if I step in the acid even once, like five minutes of progress is gone because it heals by that much as well. And to make things worse, I'm about to get a notification that I'm gonna get six hour logged. You're trolling me. Everything that can possibly go wrong is going wrong. See, look at it heal up. Obviously, I should be avoiding every acid pull possible, but sometimes, you know, I'm just trying to stay alive. And it heals up 3%, and that's another 10 minutes of my life. Fucking trolling me, dude. Lily, I've been on this phase for 20 fucking minutes. Thank you. No way, dude. I'm actually so mad. I'm so mad. One hour. 
I was there for one hour and I had it on eight HP, heals up. I don't see the fireball coming in time. I'm walking because that's how I was doing the Wooks walk and stuff. I should have just turned on my run instantly when I realized I wasn't gonna get it because I kind of didn't know I was about to die. And I just, I just died. An hour of my life, I'm gonna go take a depression nap because I'm not doing that again right now. I need to get more antidotes, more super combats, more everything. I can't believe that. I've pretty much already wasted two hours on this task and I'm about to waste like another hour or so. I need to get Eye of Newts for super attack potions and then I need to go get magic roots to make antidotes because I'm all out on those attempts. I was literally there for an hour and I had it on 24 HP and everything went wrong. Okay, that's six or seven super combat pots. If that doesn't get the job done, I don't know what will, dude. I'll actually lose my mind. All right, we have 30 antidotes, so that might be working. All right, we go again. I have to try and avoid as many acid pools as possible. I'm literally starting the kill on one HP because obviously you max on your first hit when something's full HP. So I'm trying to get any damage I can. Just do some damage, dude. Please. I hate RuneScape, I hate RuneScape. 48 minutes. I actually hate RuneScape so much. That took me three hours to do and a depression nap. Oh my god, why, why? I hate RuneScape so much, bro. Fucking hell, let's go get real gear. 48 minutes 30, I actually hate my life. Holy shit, let's go do this 50 more kills of Warcath. That was really traumatizing. And so is having over 50% of you not subscribe to the channel. Sort it out, hit that sub button, it's the best way to support me. Wow, that is a lot more fun. We're at 86 KC, still no unique like a dragon bone necklace, which I think is fairly common and it's 200 points. So I'm pretty upset about that to be honest, but yeah. New PB 029, I could definitely get like a 20 second kill if I just hit it during the acid phase, but it's a bit sus with mage. Okay, and that is all the Vorkath combat achievements done. 100 KC. Unfortunately, no Dragon Bone Necklace for that extra 200 points. Gave us some logs and stuff for our fire making, which is nice. And that 200 points gets us 68,920. We are back as rank 8. Boom, rank 8. 68,920 points. We need to push for 70k. Time to hit a huge combo breaker by doing the Inferno combat achievements. Doing all of the Inferno combat achievements gives 400 points for a master task. Killing Zuck five times, which is one of the achievements, is a 200 point elite task. And reaching 700 combat achievement points is a 200 point elite task as well. So I could go up 800 points very quickly if I'm able to do them all. I basically have four attempts because I already have one KC done. The achievements I have to do are kill the triple jads within 30 seconds of each other, do the inferno without using magic spells at all, kill Zuck without killing the jad that spawns by doing a jad skip on Zuck, doing the Inferno without letting the melee or dig at all, killing Zuck without using any range or mage weapons before the Zuck wave, and killing Zuck without letting my hit points fall below 50 during any wave in the Inferno at all. I'm gonna try and do as many as possible at one time, so on the first attempt I'm gonna be focusing on the one where you don't equip a mage or a range weapon at all. I think it's intended for people to use melee on the main game, but I can actually just manually cast my spells the entire time and just not wear a mage or range weapon, and that'll count. I'm also going to try and do the 50 HP one, and the one where I don't let a melee or dig. The Abyssal Dagger actually has Mage bonus by the way, plus one Mage bonus, so that's what we're going to use for the Inferno CA, where we can't use any major ranged weapons before wave 69. Yeah, I'm putting my left click on the Tumican Shadow to use, so I literally can't mess up, and then I just have to remember it before Zuck to put it back on. No. Damn it, dude. I took so long there. Oh well. We have five attempts to do all of all those things. Triples time while manually costing.
looking back at this, I should have had my shadow on long range. I got dragged out and tanked a Zuck hit and failed the 50 HP task. Oh my god, I almost spawned Jad. Oh fuck, I did. Oh my god. It's not looking good, is it? Just kill the Major. And right about now is when I made the freestyle decision to just go for the Jad skip because I'd already failed the 50 HP in the Melier one. I wanted to get something else done. Alright, I did facing Jad on and Jab, what are you doing here? I kind of messed up and I got hit, so I couldn't do the minus 50 HP one and I couldn't do the dig one. So I just freestyled it and I did the one where I did the Jad skip. Kind of sus, but hey, it is what it is. Um, what else do we have to do? Okay, five times I'm doing it anyway. I'm going to try and do the one without letting it dig. That one I can do. That one I can do. Okay, I should be able to do them all. I just can't use any mage spells. So this is the one where you can't use any mage spells, but somehow the Tumic and Shadow doesn't count as a mage spell. So I'm just straight up not going to cast any Blood Barrage, any Ice Barrage, just hit things with my Shadow the entire way through, and it should get me the completion. HP, bro, and I like, I'm walking, right? I'm walking, Wook's walking, and the fucking, um, oh, damn it, dude, fuck. Uh, we'll do that next time. <laughs> um... Failed the 50 HP one again, unfortunately, but we're still on track to do all the others. We need to kill all three Jads within 30 seconds of each other. Bro, they like die so quick, what? That's such a cheat code. So the, the healers never respawn. That's crazy. X. 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 Wasn't even close, bro. 700 combat achievement points, 69,120 points, playing with Jads completed. Now let's do the Zuck. Oh, mass damage. Bro, I'm gonna get a set. No, I'm not. Oh, I am. Oh! Shit. That was kind of scary. I gotta remember I can't blood barrage these healers. Did I just take a jad hit? <laughs> From trash. Oh. Dude, this is sus. I'm so bad. Boom, Nibble, Nibbler Chaser, the floor is lava. 
New PB as well. What else do I have to do now? Is the question. That was clean, bro. I don't care what anyone says. Ah, oh, the fucking 50 HP one, dude. <gasps> no, dude! What hit me, bro? Fuck. This is my fourth KC out of the five, and I just failed the 50 HP one again, which means my next one is my last attempt. What? Oh, maybe not. That was a bit sus, dude. I would have just killed it by maging it, dude. <laughs> 4004. That could have been a lot quicker if I wasn't trash. One more attempt for the combo breaker. 5kc is 200 points and one of the last combat achievements, which just means I have to do this next run without going under 50 HP. First points per hour for me. If you really think about Bro, it. it's because of the execution. Don't blame the battle plan. The ex execution was there. Agree or disagree? Disagree. All right. Maybe it was bad then. I'm so mad. I just, I just, I just failed it. I'm way fucking 63, dude. No, what? Say something smart now, nine two. Say something, bro. Please. At least I can Take do 15, dude. Decide. At least I can do 15, right? No, fucking... Just die and do it again. <laughs> Complete the Inferno five times. Let's go. 200 points. I have to go do another one to go get the 50 HP one because I suck at the game. Finally managed to get past wave 63 without falling under 50 HP. I was just throwing so many at times. And now we can just complete it and get it done. Wasn't even close. Jesus Christ, that took me one more attempt than I wanted it to, but there we go. The Inferno Combat Achievement's done, a Master Toss done, 69,720 points. Let's push for 70k now. I hate that I have to go to 6kc because it means I could pretty much just go to 10 at this point. And I don't want to because I've just done 5 Inferno straight. But yeah, very happy with that. Vorkath takes me 30 seconds to a minute to kill. And if I kill 50 more, it's an 80 point hard task. And if I spoon one of those drops, it's 200 points right there and I'm at 70k. So I'm going to do that first. That is 150 Vorkath KC. I did not spoon the Dragon Bone Necklace or the Visage, unfortunately. The Dragon Bone Necklace is only 1 in 200, so there's a decent chance we could get it. 69.8k points. Let's figure out a way to push for the 70k. Alright, it's time to get 50 more fire making. I might be throwing using these logs, but I'm sure I can get them back later. And that is 50 million fire making XP. Very, very nice. 70,000 points. It's time to take another rank and get some more points. Always keeping some little 10 point tasks for when we need to take over a rank. That is 25 oak stalks for 10 points. I just need to go kill a Cableton or however you pronounce it and go get an Eye of Newt as well. And we're about to take rank seven. Eye of Newt, let's go. We really be saving the points. Make an attack potion for 10 points, 70,020, and we are rank seven with over 70,000 points. I also have the Zuck Pet from previous leagues, which you can just reclaim, and I'm gonna use it to clickbait you guys. Remember to subscribe, buy my merch. I'll see you tomorrow.